Yum, yum. William Vaughn here with a quick introduction to using mesh items that contain edge weighting when working with Mesh Fusion and Moto. When working with subdivision surfaces, Moto enables you to assign weight values to edges as an alternative to adding hold edges. This allows you to create sharper edges while maintaining a lighter cage mesh. By default, Mesh Fusion won't apply edge weighting, but Mesh Fusion can simulate edge weighting by internally adding loops to the source meshes based on the edge weight values. To take advantage of this feature, simply activate the edge weights option for the Fusion item. Once activated, you can choose the weight loop type you'd like to work with. Double loops will add two edge loops on either side of each weighted edge, while single loops only adds one loop, producing a cleaner, less dense mesh. Adaptive loop count determines whether a double or single loop should be applied based on the source mesh topology. Since every mesh's topology is different, I'd recommend giving each option a try and then choose what works best for each setup. Oh, look at the time.